We've gone through history and seen how ledgers have evolved from stone tablets to double entry ledgers. We even took a look at the earliest known example of distributed ledgers. Now, let's discuss the evolution of the ledger in the modern world. Over the last few decades, ledgers have moved from the written form to the digital form, also known as computers and digitalized databases. This has allowed us to be interconnected, a truly global economy. Today, this record keeping system is being revolutionized again, going from the digital realm or centralized databases keeping track of transactions to information being stored across different locations across the globe. This system of record information across a global network is what we call decentralized ledgers. A decentralized ledger can be described as a ledger of any transactions or contracts supported by a decentralized network from across different locations and people, eliminating the need of a central authority. When a recording is made, every participant is notified of that recording. They now own an identical copy of the record of transactions, identical to every other node on that network. Every piece of information on a blockchain can be traced back to the exact moment when it was created. So, if an audit is necessary, information can be found and deemed reliable. This allows blockchain to serve as a truly reliable storage of public records and transactions, and therefore eliminating the need for a centralized authority of database of records. Now that we understand the foundational principle of blockchain, distributed ledgers, it's important to understand another important key element that makes blockchain so revolutionary. Trust. Trust is created through two key principles, collaboration and cryptography, both of which will be discussed shortly.